I'm really proud of myself for finally getting to London Stadium on time and not one minute before kickoff or five minutes after. So it's a good day for me being on time. Welcome to East London again. Yay. I feel like the restaurants around here are so posh. They just look nice. Big skyscraper. So as you know, Leverkusen is really doing well in the Bundesliga right now, which makes this a scary game for West Ham, but I think West Ham will still win. 3-1. You see the game against Fulham? Yeah, I did. A sad day. Yes. Beautiful day. Good weather. I'm bad in the office in the Yeah. Are you proper East London then? Yeah, I'm kind of turned full. Bread. Oh, wow. So you've been here when Millwall was still in the league. I Essex, but I'll come back for the games. Oh, so you're real yeah, dedicated. Yeah, fan. Who's your favorite player of all time? Must have. Bobby Moore, it's got me. Bro okay. Bobby Moore. But today's day, probably Bamber Bowen, because he's doing it for us, isn't it? Bowen's on fire. <laughs> and he's shagging yeah. daddy time. <laughs> I love that, it's so funny. No, I'm not up to date. I'm on the Premier League. I always watch the Premier League. Like, yes. I don't really come to these ones because I don't like when we lose. <laughs> but I like to come, it's his first game, and hopefully. Oh. Oh, I hope so too then for you guys. What a fun little area of London. People are just rollerblading in this crowd. Like, I don't understand why, but respect. Two minutes walking and I have already been recognized as the Man City girl. So this, this swag. What a view of London from the east side. Bayer Leverkusen has been on a very good run so far. They are top of the Bundesliga. They are actually going to take away Bayern Munich's 11 year streak of winning the title. So them coming to London Stadium tonight makes it a very anxious night for a lot of West Ham supporters. Even anxious for me because I'm quite a sympathetic person. Um, but they seem to be very optimistic. I don't think I have a real score prediction here because when I've come to watch West Ham play, they've always played with an issue with the midfield. But very entertaining, very, very nice team to watch play, and it can be literally anything. Like, I, I can't give a score prediction just because it's always so random. This is the busiest it's been at West Ham and all the games I've come to, and rightfully so, it's a huge game. I love the diversity of people coming straight from work to go watch the football here. You can tell because it is in their suits though. I feel like it's so cool outside right now that I don't even want to go in yet, but now I'm interested to see what the concourse looks like. With this busy and enthusiastic outside, inside must be really good. The only United that I recognize is West Ham United. The other Uniteds. I just got kind of lost, like really lost, but now I'm getting forward to see. We're in the pitch, I don't even know. I'm going to check out the pitch now. I've heard a lot of iron chants so far. A lot. Very loud. This is a new area I've never been to. Hmm. Okay, I didn't know they had a mask out. Look at the screen. What is that? Is that a marshal? I'm so confused right now. Oh my god. I don't think I've ever properly seen like football drills done like this. It's so funny. Whoa! Airplane! Aeroplane! Wait, why does that excite me so much? It's like an hour to kick off right now. So, that's why there's empty seats, you know? God, that's so funny! That actually just hit me! <laughs> Ghanaian Hammers! All the way from Ghana! That's crazy! Good for you! <laughs> you think we're gonna win tonight? Uh, West Ham win. Hopefully, hopefully. I'd like to see Kudu's bang a hat-trick, to be quite honest. I'd love to see a hat-trick. Anything could happen, anything could happen. Yeah. Oh my god. They're already getting into it. Oh, cool. 
corrupt ref. Two nights of bad refs from the European leagues, man. Champions League and Europa League. The refs just got me bugging. That gave me blue balls. And I'm a girl. Fucking hell. Oh. Damn. The other team crowd makes me laugh as much as West Ham. They just say the funniest thing. I can't repeat any of them, but they're funny. I think West Ham's gonna win. I always thought that though. It's 1-0 right now. And the atmosphere has been absolutely fantastic. This has been the best West Ham atmosphere I've ever been to, and I'm really happy to be here to experience it. And it's just hilarious. Like, I think East London is the funniest part of London. So enthusiastic. I think most authentic as well. Like, definitely the most proper club in London. Halftime on the concourse, and everyone is so tall. Like, I think the average height here is literally 6'1". I don't know how. All really tall. Everyone here is just so nice. I don't know what it is. Everyone's just happy and a good mood. I haven't had a bad experience here ever. I, I really can't wait. Back at the area that I think is really beautiful, but smells really bad because of all the cigarettes. One of my favorite stadiums for half time, really. Running back, second half starting, the footy is back, on my way to my seat. 46 minutes, accidentally missed one minute. Oopsie. The only United. I'm hearing a lot of good boy in this crowd. They tend to say good boy. But I'm gonna start saying bad boy. The funniest crowd in the Premier League, in the entire English League, West Ham United. Hilarious. <laughs> What's the fucking difference? Oh, this is so funny. The guy behind me is just the funniest person I think I've ever been around. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is the worst ref I've ever seen, and I've seen Simon Hooper ref Spurs and Liverpool. This is a bad ref. I don't know who he is, but I'm gonna find out his name. I'm keeping him in the back of my mind. In a bad way. I might have to become the hate club president of this ref as well. I mean, that's why we were singing. Not real. It actually cannot be real. You're not fit to referee. You're not fit. You're not fit. You're not fit to referee. How was that a corner? Sort yourself out. Is what someone just said. I wish I was as funny as English people. Oh my god. Or just West Ham people. What? I, I, my eyes have seen new things this football match that I've never seen before. In a bad way. <laughs> what? From the referee, that is. Alvarez is going to take it off, but I still think West Ham is going to win 1 0. I think we're in a good I think West Ham is going to win the
The shame about the Champions League as well, what can I say? The European League just bums me out. Another lovely night at West Ham with top tier entertainment, S tier entertainment. Still really not over City losing yesterday though. I'm, I've been quite sad all day. This did not help. Well, it did. It did. But it lost. So. I look so incognito when I walk around like this. But it's only because of the rain. I'm not trying to hide. I'm still crying over City. So I do have tears. This isn't the rain. Damn, this is sad. The end of the Europa Nights at West Ham, at London Stadium. My favorite part of West Ham games is definitely just the irons that you hear literally the first two hours before the game starts and the last two hours of it after it ends. <laughs> More running at West Ham again every time. Really good game today. Very entertaining. I think the ref genuinely corrupt. I think yesterday's ref at the City game genuinely corrupt. Once again, I don't know why. I always come to West Ham games when I'm sad. Like I'm really sad about City with the pens yesterday. And I don't know. Being at West Ham made it a little bit better, but then they lost as well. So it's just football. American learning that football and emotions, they go together a lot, but CTID.